Hello guys, it's JMBGRJ96 here and I'm back with another Let's Play. This one is going to be of Terraria. Um, it is a fun game. Uh, I will get more in depth on what they actually, what it actually is later. So yeah, let's just get started. I already have one character, but I'm going to delete him. Yes, delete. And I'll sh there's one guy and I'll go through the character creations. So hair. You can change your hair, see there's many different kinds of um, hairstyles, I think there's 17 total, is it? Yeah. So, I really liked the, I think it was, yeah, 14. There we go. Because I think 15 and 16 is bald. Um, so, I passed it again, sorry. Oh, I'm just going to get back to my hair. There we go. And now the color is based on, like, this red, green, blue kind of scheme. It's not like, um, you type in a color or anything like that, so... It's a little annoying. Um, I'll keep the hair color like that. I'll keep the skin color like that. Eyes. I kind of want purple. Just like bright purple eyes. There we go. There we go. Bright purple eyes. Then cl skin I want to keep the same. And clothes. Let's have a red shirt. No, let's have a green shirt. Let's just have a green shirt. I want like a dark green a little bit. Yeah, right there. Now let's go undershirt. Let's have our red undershirt. Red undershirt. There we go. Now let's do white pants. White pants. And white is like all... I should have said this earlier, guys. I'm sorry. But white is just all of the colors or at the max um red is all red green and blue at zero green is where it's red and blue at zero and greens all the way up and blue is with red and green at zero and blue all the way up and then you can just kind of vary it between that and then the shoes i'm going to do gold and that's just red and green all the way up and there we go he, looking like a boss and then back Create and then we'll do GMBG RJ96. Except, oh yeah, looking like a boss. And this is my server, I'm not gonna play on that. Um, this is a different world that I made. This was for a previous let's play, but I ended up effing it up. But I really like the world, so and stuff is just like a random world. I'm gonna delete that and I'm gonna do create world. I'll create a, I'll do a medium world, I guess, and let's call it, let's play Terraria, except, and now while it's loading, guys, I'll talk a little bit more about the game itself, so Terraria is a lot, people say it's a lot like Minecraft, and it's sort of buff in Minecraft, it's not at all, well, the main difference is that it's, Terraria is 2D and Minecraft is 3D, so that's a big difference. Um, and Terraria is... I don't want to start a hate war, guys, but I think Terraria is a lot more fun than Minecraft. Um, and yeah, um, Terraria has a lot more items in it, has a lot more enemy types in it, has just a lot more content in it than Minecraft does, and I hope that changes, Notch, if you're listening, I hope that changes in the previous, er, in the future updates coming up in Minecraft, uh, 1.6.5, I think it was, came out a little bit ago, so, that's getting, so it's getting closer to the release, um, Terraria is up on Steam, you can buy it for, I think, $10, or you can buy, like, a three-pack for, I think, like, or four pack for I think like thirty dollars or something like that. So yeah, so this is oh god. And right away I already fell. Um this is Terraria, the game itself. And what you just heard if you heard that smash it was um <coughs> sorry guys. If you heard that it was a pot and pots are pre-gened all over the world. They contain anything from torches to money. Um, they can have shurikens, potions, um, 
all kind of stuff like that. And right now, just ignore this. This is me just mining some iron. Let me just get that stone out of there. There we go. So there we go. I got some iron. Let me get that mushroom. Let me just get this copper. So right away, there's copper, which Minecraft doesn't have. So there's a difference right there. Um, another thing is, I don't know if you saw it, but when I first spawned, hold on, I gotta find a way back up there. Oh, let me just take a dirt block. And see this dirt background? With this kind of wall, I can put blocks on them. And see right here, that is another thing that Minecraft does not have, NPCs. There are a few mods that have those, but I don't think it's good enough. Um... Well, right now, I guess I can start getting a house put together. So, first things first, get some wood. And I'm just going to swing my axe, get some wood. And you start off with a iron, or a copper pick and a copper axe. So, now I'm just going to continue chopping. There we go. Continue chopping. And there we go. Now, I'm going to need to make some wooden platforms. And hit escape to bring up your inventory. This is your inventory. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Wait, I think I counted. No, it is 10 by um 4. So there's 40 spots in your inventory. There you go. I just built something for the guide to get across. There we go. Come on, guide. Let's go. Time to go home. Come on. Dumb guide. The guide is... I'm going to warn you right now, if you do get this game, the guide is extremely annoying. But he does help you if you are a noob player at this, like a beginner. There we go. Just help him get down. Um, He can be pretty annoying while you're building stuff. See, like right now, see how he's just walking towards me and he's gonna start getting in the way of my building. Get out of the way, you dumb guide. And I'll get more in on the more in depth on the NPCs later, but for right now, <coughs> sorry guys. Um, but for right now, I'll just leave it at the guide. And um, yeah. So let me just put these doorways in one one two three I want four there we go let me just chop these down one two three and now I'm gonna open up my uh, inventory my crafty menu workbench is ten wood which is basically about one normal size tree basically which is about maybe that tall and um yeah so then I'm gonna wanna make a door Two doors actually, and those are six wood each, so twelve wood. Put one there and one there. Alright, so now I'm going to head out. And I do have a server, guys, so if you do actually get this game, um send me your I'll send me a message if you want to play on my server, and then I will message you back the um Hamachi account and um yeah, I'll send you the message about the server. I'll um, tell you the IP, the IP address and everything. And yeah, so um, just send me a message. I'll get back to you as soon as I can with the IP if you get this game and want to play. And we'll build some awesome stuff and have an epic adventure, I guess. So right now, I just need to go and find some slimes, because in this game, there's no coal. It's all slime gels is what you use to make torches. And there's no fuel for furnaces or anything. And speaking of furnaces, I should probably get some stone. To make a furnace, you're going to need three torches, which is one slime and one wood. I think it's three wood and uh, 20 stone. So I got, oh, is this a cave entrance? Yes, it is. Nice. So let me just kill the slime. Got two slime. Yes. So there we go. Let me just get some more trees. And um, in Terrarium, it does have biomes like Minecraft does. There's forests. There's deserts. Um, plains. Everything like that. And there's 
There is also floating islands, which are pretty self-explanatory. Um, they're islands that float in the air. There are there's corruption, which is like an evil land, I guess you could say. <coughs> Sorry, guys, stupid like allergies and stuff. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, there's corruption, which is like evil. There is the underground jungle. Which does I know it was like what an underground jungle that doesn't make any sense. But um, when you play it, that it has a lot of good items in it. So yeah. So right now I just gotta explore, get some more wood. And when you first generate the world, if you gen if you walk far enough, either left or right, you will encounter eventually some huge trees that give you about maybe 80 wood f per tree, which is pretty friggin' amazing. See like right here. Look how tall those are. And now watch, I'm at 21. This isn't the tallest tree ever, but watch, ready? Comes down, rain and wood. That one gave me about 30, 32 maybe. So yeah, see, they give you a lot of wood. So, there we go. I think 80 wood should do. Um, so now I'm going to head back. Let me just get this last tree. And I'll head back. Is it me or does my hair look purple? There we go. Well, it looks a little purple to me. Leave a leave a comment if you think my hair is purple or not. I know, I'm just kidding, guys. Don't do that. It'd be really kind of stupid, just pointless to do it. Not stupid, but like pointless just to leave a comment if my hair looks purple or not. Um. So yeah, let's just get um back to my house. Ah, uh, shoot. Yes, made it. All right. Um. Let's get back to my house, finish it, and um, then survive against countless waves of enemies. Alright, here we go. And leave a comment, guys, on what you want me to do. If you want me to explore, if you want me to mine, if you want me to build, just let me know and I'll do it. Um, and then when night turns, guys, I should have said this when I was talking about the guide earlier. But when night falls, the guide will move in if you have these, if you have this following criteria. Um, you have to have a house with a table, a chair, a door, and net, and a light source. Hold on, I just need to stand up. There we go. Um, you also need. I think, and just for any NPC to move in, you need a table, a door, your house has to have walls, and I'll show you, like, I, I'll show you what I mean by walls, I mean, not like these kinds of walls, but, like, like the background walls. There we go. Jump up here, get this one, there we go. And yes, NPC, yes, guy, I'll give you your own room. No, that's too small. There we go. There we go. Now, th this is what I mean by walls. These kind of walls. So I'm going to get about 50, maybe... S I'll go 100 on these. Because you have extra, you can just save them for future NPCs. There we go. Oh, shit, I need to make a hammer. And to replace these walls and furniture, you need a hammer to, like, knock these walls out and put new ones or to, like, move the workbench over. I'm going to put a piece of dirt right there for now. I think I need four more walls, so let me just go like that. And one wood makes four walls, so it's a pretty good deal in terms of, like, resource saving. And now let me put up some light. There's a torch there, torch there, torch there, torch there, and torch there. Go outside, pull it right there. Come here, slime. Slime, get back here. No! Oh, two of them, yes. Give me some slime. Gel. What did I get? Oh, I have 11 gels? I never even noticed that. Oh, well. Um, now I know I got them. So let me just head back, climb up here. <coughs> There we go. Now let me just put another door in. 
right there for the NPC. Now let me make a table and a chair. And so you can right click on them and he'll tell you all about this stuff like help. He'll help you, he can tell you what to do and whatnot. So let me open that door up just so I know what to place it. There we go. Jeez, guide. Fighting off the signs on his own. Who needs me, right? Alright, so, never mind. He, he signed a contract, so he has to stick with me. And these are bombs. You get these out of, um, you get these out of the, uh, pots as well. In underground, there are also chests, so you might want to watch out for those. I need some more torches. There we go. Now, if I scroll down, I should be able to make a furnace. Oh, it's forward. Forward, my bad. So furnace, and that right there, that is a demon eye, that is one of the enemies in the game. There are slimes, zombies, and skeletons, and there are, pl there are a lot of different classifications and slimes. God, what are you doing? Come inside. Apparently the guy doesn't want to move from his spawn. And I just got owned. So, um... What zombies are pretty powerful. Oh, my spawn is right next to the guide. Nice. So let me close that. I need to make a sword. First, let me smelt this copper. Let me smelt this iron. Here we go. Let me make a wooden sword. Well, I can make a chest. Nah, I think I'll save that to save my iron for an anvil. Could, and you need an anvil so you can make, like, um, the bars that you found, the ores. You can need a furnace to make those into bars, and you need an anvil to make th those bars into tools, such as pickaxes, axes, and stuff like that. Close that, go on to the other side. Come here, zombies. Let's go. Bring it on. Oh yeah, fighting them back. Fighting them back. And if you're not sure about buying this game, guys, um, if you go on YouTube, it might be in my subscriptions, too. I subscribe to them. But the creators of this game have a Let's Play series, um, and they are probably a little bit better than me, because, after all, they are the creators of the actual game, so... Oh, I got a lens. Nice. I also got 15 copper and 4 silver. There we go. Alright, um... I think I might cut it here, guys, after I kill this demon eye. Oh, God, that was close. So I s All right, after I kill this demon eye, guys, then I'll cut it out. And if you scroll over them, you can see your or their health, and this is your health up here. It's kind of obvious, but just so I'd say it. Fight them off. Oh, my God, my house is slowly getting overrun. Close the door. Come here, demon eye. Yeah. Yes. Come on. Come on, come on. Slice. Slice. Yes. Yes, I got two lenses. Alright, let's do work. Come on. Come on. Come on in, son. Eat wooden sword. No, don't die. Don't die. E yes. And I don't know if you saw it, guys, earlier, but the death penalty is... Um, you just drop your coins. You just drop half the amount of coins that you have. So if I died right now, I would drop... Oh, mother! Sorry, that was just my mom. I have to go into baseball pretty soon, so... Um... So, if I died right now, I would lose... Um... Yes, mother! Yes! Sorry, I just ignore that. It's my mom, and she's just being freaking annoying. And she doesn't know I'm doing a Let's Play! So... Um, sorry about that, guys. Just ignore her. She's being pretty annoying. So as I was saying, if I died right now, I would I would drop four silver and thirty three copper. So just a quick look at that. I'm gonna make one more chair and see if I can make some goggles. Uh, I don't think I can. Yes, I can. To make goggles, all you need is two lenses, and you get them from killing the demon eyes. I'm gonna make some goggles. And guys, ready for this? Ready for this? Sup? Look like a boss. No, actually, I look like a boss. Oh, yeah. That's right. Alright, guys. I think I'll end it here. 
Uh, thanks for watching. Watch for part two. Watch Demi Logic, and like I said in the earlier, leave me a message if you want to join my server. I have one up, and I will be having a more, uh, better character than what I usually have. And I might also record, so you might get a chance to be on YouTube. So, um, let me know, guys. Leave me a me send me a message. Leave me a comment on what you want me to do. And, yeah, thanks for watching.